Hello, everybody, and welcome to episode five of the Mythos Rosebud Challenge Let's Play. This is Christina, aka Imagining Mystic. And in our last episode, we have been working on getting exactly what we need to bring in our spouse. And I think we're actually pretty close now. Um, we've got a toilet, we've got a sink, we've got a fridge. Uh, I actually do need to check the rules and see if there's anything else that I need, but I'm pretty sure that's it. Um, and then, yeah, we're going to start moving somebody in. I don't know that I've actually really decided on who I'm going to move in. I was thinking I wanted to get somebody with creative, um, the creative trait, because we're going to mostly be making money off of what we create. So a creative sim is going to be able to do that a little bit more with a creative sim. Um, all right. So let's see, uh, improving, let's see. Adding a spouse requires walls, a door and a window, plumbing of at least a toilet and a sink, fridge for meals and a sleeping spot. Okay, so we basically have everything. I just need to decide who I'm gonna bring in. Um, this guy, related to anybody? Bryce? You can move Bryce in. I don't remember if he's an adult or not. Blaine? He's a geek and a genius. Well, he could probably um, gloomy, insane, and neat. I want somebody that's creative. Oh, this guy, Herbert. Oh, but he's already married. Well, gosh darn it. Um, anybody here? I don't think, I don't think I have anybody that's creative. All right. So basically I need to find somebody that's creative. Okay. That's what I'm doing. Not that it really matters. I guess I could have her bring in anybody, really. And her and Don Lothario would probably make some really beautiful children. I'm just saying. Maybe we're going to move Don Lothario in anyway, because why not? All right. Let me have her wake up, use the bathroom. I don't think we have a shower yet. But we'll get one eventually. All right. Yeah, maybe we'll have him... Maybe we'll make friends with him. But first, she needs to go take a shower after she's done eating. Yeah, eat some cereal. And then you can go take a shower. And then hopefully we'll meet up with Don Lothario somewhere. Because, yeah, you guys would have some really, really cute kids. Not that that's, like, super important. But, yeah, seriously, who wouldn't want to see what their kids look like? I mean, they're both rather good-looking sims. All right, let's have her go to the gym and have her take a shower. And with any luck, Don Lothario will be there because he's kind of a gym rat. I could actually invite him there if he's not already there. Not available for travel. How much do you want to bet he's actually already there? I, I think it's probably a pretty good bet. The other thing that I need to get better at doing, and people were reminding me of this in the comments... I need to get better at collecting things because that's how I'm making my money. I need to like go around and collect every stinking thing that I find because that's kind of important. All right. No. Yes, he's there. <laughs> okay. Um, go take a shower first, and then you can uh, you can go talk to him. All right. There you go. Let's see if we can get him moved in. Yeah, I don't think he's actually dating. What's her face? One of the Calientes, I don't even know. Trisha Foot. Hurry up with that shower. Okay, you're done. Come on. Oh, Travis Scott. Look at her coming down in a towel. Oh my gosh. He is single. Okay, cool. Um well good. Compliment appearance. Seriously, though, these two would have some pretty good-looking children. I know you need some fun. I know. I know. Just hang on. Non-committal. Oh, that's right. But that's okay. We're not going to have to marry him. We're just going to move him in. That's cool, right? And he just made her energetic. Well, she can make a lot of money... Uh, Writing workout books, um, which actually somebody gave me a suggestion on a workout book, I think. 
Maybe it was a motivational book. I'll have to look it up. Um, discuss interests. And where's deep conversation? Where are you going? Dude, you can't just, can't just leave. Okay, um, go watch some TV. Watch action, because you're already energized. There you go. Let's just get your fun up real quick. And actually, I don't think we have a computer at our house yet, so I should probably have her go right. Let's just get her fun up nice and high. There we go. Okay. Go to the library. And get her to write another book so that we can start bringing in some more money. I could also have her do some painting, too. I mean, she is creative. So we can definitely start doing that. Okay. Uh, right. Actually, you know what? Let's get her. Oh, she could write a, another workout book. Hang on. I gotta, I gotta look up the last suggestion. I know somebody gave me a suggestion and I will be, I will give you a shout out as soon as I remember because I've got mommy brain and I don't remember anything ever. Um, okay. I think it's on this one. Let's see. Oh, here it is. Brian says, for your next workout book, uh, perhaps gaining Hermes' blessing, training with Perseus. Okay, we are going to do that one. We are going to give you... Yeah, well, we're going to give that title a try. Okay. So let's see. <clears throat> gaining Hermes' blessing, training with Perseus. Perseus. There we go. Alrighty, and there's our book. Go ahead and write in your towel, because you never changed. We're going to just uh, triple speed through this part, just because it's, uh, it's going to take a while for her to get through a book. So we're going to do that, and then I have to see what we can gather, because we need to gather before we leave here. Oh, look, fruit. I could actually start gathering other things, too, because all of this stuff is going to be useful at some point. Don't have any harvestable pears. What's that? Flowers? I can sell flowers. Dig. And harvest. And actually, she could eat these before she leaves. Harvest. Q is full. Okay, fine. All right, she's actually already almost done with that book. Sweet. All right, there we go. Write five good books. Okay. Where'd she go? Oh, hey, there's food here. Is it good? Everything is bad? Ugh. All of it's bad. Seriously? Oh, well. So I just played my legacy family and I just tried to sell the um, time capsules because a few of you suggested that I do that, but it actually bugged the game. Like it caused the uh, the hand to not be able to put anything down. I, I don't know if I just did something wrong, but I was not able to sell them. Actually, you know what? I got to have her go home because I need to get that book sold before uh, before 10. So let's get her to go back, sell the book real quick, and then I'm going to probably invite um, Don Lothario over so that we can uh, start working our on our relationship with him. Okay. Sell. Okay, that should uh, that should get her some money. Have cereal, and then you may pass out for a little while, and then you will call Don Lothario. Uh, 
All right. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. All right, sleep. There we go. And we got, ooh, 330 simoleons. Not too shabby. Okay, that's good enough. I want to get Dawn over. Pee. Is he coming? Yes. Sweet. All right, there he is. Hi. Uh, let's see. Can I do a deep conversation? Oh, I can do a get to know though. Ask about career. If he has a job, I'm gonna um, make sure that he quits it as soon as uh, he joins the family. Uh oh, uh oh, oh no. You embarrassed yourself. What'd you do? Sorry. Self-deprecating joke. Alright, well, she's not embarrassed anymore. Alright, stop with that. He is a doctor at the Simulcrum Labs. Oh, he's a doctor? Really? Alright, chat. Uh, get to know. Non-committal, romantic, and active. Okay. Seriously, though, the children that these two are going to have are going to be freaking gorgeous. I'm just saying. Oh, now he's focused. Okay. Get the pep talk. Uh, there's about interests. Oops, don't go there. Uh, let's see. Friendly. Great day. Compliment outfit. Discuss favorite band. Okay. Let's get you guys to friendly status. Uh... Let's try another. Let's try another flirt. Let's see if that works better this time. All right, don't get embarrassed this time, dude. Oh, okay, that worked better. So so. She's like, yeah, I'm hot. I can't help it. Okay. Uh, what else can we do? Compliment appearance. <laughs> oh, haha, <laughs> thanks. Yeah, I have nice shiny white teeth. I am absolutely beautiful, and I drive a red shiny sports car. And I am gorgeous. Of course you should confess your attraction. I like ham, or whatever the heck that is. And you are gorgeous. Yes, I like tanks as well. And you are gorgeous. <laughs> oh, I love it. Um, let's see. Ask a risque question. So, rocket ships and hearts. What do you think? Okay, cool. We we're starting to build some flirtiness. Uh, yes, grilled cheese. That's a, that's a good way to get the romance going. Talking about food. Actually, I don't know. It works for me. I love food. <laughs> True story, Pinstar actually did that on our first date. True story. Whisper sweet nothings. <laughs> Are you guys gonna just 
become friends or something now. Below a kiss. First kiss? We should be able to do a first kiss. <laughs> that reaction, though. Ah, I'm pretty sure this is not Don Lothario's first kiss. Sorry to break it to you, Persephone. Uh, we already did a first kiss. Sool, Sool. I know you're hungry. Just hang on. I'm trying to get him to friend. Just hang on! You can do it! Look at how pretty she looks when she's in her flirty pose. Oops. Come on! I don't think we're going to be able to ask him to move in until the friendship is a little bit higher. Yes, I know you're non-committal. Don't worry. Where are you going? No, no, no. You're not leaving. Uh-uh. I don't think it's a good idea to ask him to move in just yet. No, don't leave! Don Lothario, no! Okay. Hey, you're back. Thanks. All right, let's, uh... I don't know if he's going to accept her proposal to be boyfriend because he's non-committal. Um, I might need to get him a separate bed. Let's ask him to move in, see what happens. All right, hey, he didn't turn her down. I hope he's... He does live with the Calientes, right? Yes. Okay. Good. Good. Okay. I don't have to worry about uh, him bringing in any money then. That's good. Alrighty. All nighter. Okay, yes, I know you're hungry. Just hang on. Have cereal. What can I do to have him make some money? Oh, he wants a boyfriend or a girlfriend, but he's non committal. Look at that face! <laughs> Look at that face. Oh my god, the men flirty the male flirty pose is hilarious. It's hilarious. Um sexy pose. Kiss hands. I'm gonna attempt to ask him to be her girl her boyfriend. I uh oh, I should I should save. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save, just in case. Cause otherwise he's not gonna be able to sleep in the same bed. Which is going to be a little bit of an issue. I mean, I could just buy him a bed. Uh, what am I doing? Oh. Romance. There's no option for it. Uh, maybe I need to be flirtier? I, I don't know. There's no ask to be boyfriend. Um. Yeah, it's not there. I don't know. Um. Although if they're woohooing, then they should be able to sleep in the same bed, right? I should be work. I should be looking at stuff to collect too. I don't see any rocks or anything to dig up, though. Um, we could try for baby, but their bed is awfully close to the street. I have a feeling that's going to be a big embarrassment issue. So maybe we won't do that just yet. Okay. Um, blow a kiss. She needs some fun. 
All right. Uh, let's have her. Let's have them go to the. I guess to the library. Oh, you know what? I don't think I sold the workout book. Or did I? No, I did. Okay. Um, yeah, go to the library and play some games for a little while. Okay. Let's see. Let's have her play Sims Forever. Okay. I actually had to just pause the game for a minute because I had to call my husband. He uh, He's home this weekend. He's uh, He took the kids out and he had a question for me. So I just wanted to make sure I answered that before it was too late. But we are back to recording. Um, all right. Fun is up. Let's have her go home and sleep. I do want to have them start working on um, having babies, too. Because we're going to need more children to, uh, or more Sims in the family to start pumping out um, Sim-created items that they can sell. So we're going to, we're going to need to work on that. And I try to have somebody as a painter, somebody as a writer, somebody as a musician. Um, I could even have somebody creating furniture because that's a thing too. I think that's it. Is that it? All right, let's have her go home. I suppose Don could be the painter. I mean, he's not a super creative sim, but it doesn't matter. Like, he'll still be able to sell stuff. Yeah, I'll, uh... I'll buy him an easel because it's going to be the cheapest option of all of the of all of this kind of stuff here. Can he afford one? Yes. OK. Oh, writing jokes, too, I think. I think. Oh, and photography. Photography works, too. I wonder if he should be a photographer instead. Might be better. You know what? Oh, shoot. It already... Well, nope. He's going to be a painter. I forgot that stuff uh, eventually loses its value as soon as you buy it. So, oh, well. Here you go. Paint a flirty painting. We'll get you to sell paintings. And then maybe the next person will be a photographer. Actually, should I have them try for baby first? Let's try for baby first. I know. I'm being very indecisive. What else is new? Uh... Try for baby. He doesn't have to know, right? Wait, what happened? Try for baby. There you go. Come on. Let's throw that away. Donathario and Persephone Mythos are woohooing for the first time. Dun dun dun. Who's with the exploding feathers? All right, let's go pee on a stick. Not that we have the money for it, but I'm going to want to know. No, 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 no. Take pregnancy test. I know you're exhausted. Just hang on. Ah. Okay, fine. Wait, we can't cook. Uh, have cereal. All right, go finish painting. Finish painting. Oh, no, wait. Pee first. Sorry. Pee first. All right. Um, I guess go back to sleep. There we go. Ew, she's stinky. I need to buy a shower. I don't have, I don't have the money for it, though. Maybe his painting will sell. Probably not, though. It's the very first painting he's ever done. And it... Well, actually, it's not bad for the very first painting you've ever done. Hey! Not bad at all. Okay. Do another flirty painting, then. Might as well keep going with it. Is he seriously drawing a stick figure flirty painting? <laughs> okay. That works. Best flirty painting ever. Maybe I'll actually be able to buy a shower. Oh my god, this is seriously the best flirty painting ever. What is that? 
Is that- is that like a- a stick dog? What is that? <laughs> okay. Um. Sell. Here we go. Uh, okay. Can I buy a shower? Am I able to afford a shower? I don't actually have room for a shower in here. Well, wait, if I turn... Nope. Uh, let's move the sink outside. And let's get a shower. Oh, no! I can't afford it! I need more money! Okay, fine. Seriously? Even, like, the super cheap camping one? Oh, wow, the camping one's even more expensive than the other one. I didn't know that. Okay. Welp. Paint another painting, then. There you go. Why is she sad? Oh, she's sad because she didn't get pregnant. Aw, Persephone. That's so sad. I'm gonna just triple speed through the painting part. There we go. Okay. Hey, he's creative. All right, sell the collector. I still don't have the money. Ah! All right, eat some cereal. Almost there. Is there anything I can gather? Oh, does he have anything in his inventory? Oh, you know what I keep forgetting to check? If Blarfy's in the family inventory, and there he is. You guys had been reminding me to do that for the longest time, and I keep forgetting, and then I accidentally checked my Sims legacy instead of the Rosebud challenge, so obviously it wasn't there. All right, but we did finally sell Blarfy. Okay, there we go. Now we can... What? What? Um, I don't... I don't think that's gonna work. Oh, no. I don't know if I'm gonna... All right, shower's gonna have to go outside, I guess. Doesn't fit back there. All right, shower obtained. Bathroom is tiny. Tiny bathroom is small. All righty. I guess I could start selling these. Yep, they're earning a fair amount. And that way I can actually expand the bathroom. Then I don't have to worry about... <gasps> oh, shoot! I have to cancel his job. I forgot. I forgot. Oh, brain. Why you no work? Don't go. Don't go to work. Don't go to work. Don't go to work. Okay. Hang on. We got to cancel your job. Got to quit your job. Because we are doing an extreme rosebud challenge. There shall, ne there shall be no work for you. Okay. That's better. Um, yeah, you might as well paint again. Landscape painting? Okay. I, is it because he's outside? Maybe? Looking at all of that? I, I don't know. I assume so. Oops. Did he just say chives? <laughs> chives. I do want them to try for another baby, too. I have cereal. And yes, I know you stink, but we have a shower now. One simoleon. We have one simoleon left, guys. Hopefully this painting comes out okay. Alright, go take a shower. Where are you going? What are you, what are you doing? Sell the, sell the painting. Dawn, where you go? Oh, he's tired. One thirty-five. Okay, not bad. Career freedom. Oh wow, that actually made him happy to quit his job. Apparently, non-committal is not just for romance. It's that he doesn't want to have a job either. That's interesting. Hi, Milo. Okay. One more time at this baby thing. 
All right. Come on, guys. We got this. I wonder if Dawn is, like, se secretly using birth control or something. Oh! Whoops. They totally did it in front of somebody, didn't they? Oh, well. All right. Um... Yeah, because he's non-committal, right? If he has a baby, he has to commit. He has to commit to being a dad. Yay! Baby! Great, let's see what he says. Oh, he's actually excited! Okay. Whoa! She's already got quite the belly! My goodness. Alright. Uh... You know what? She's creative right now. Let's have her... Let's have her do a painting. Why not? All right. Um, as soon as she's done with this painting, I think we're going to end the episode there. Let's have him eat. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to see what their child looks like. Hi, Bella Goth. What are you doing? And he actually could stand to have a shower too. I wonder when they're going to start adding in the uh, woohoo and shower option again. Because that was uh, that was an option in Sims 3. Oh, and she just got royalties too. Sweet. All right. Well, we're getting there. We're getting there for the money. Finish your painting and then sell it. The other thing I want to start keeping an eye on is... Uh, how much money they're earning towards the um, Rosebud achievement. And actually, this is where I'm going to stop. I'm going to just check the Rosebud achievement real quick. Obviously, we've got a long way to go. I know we're nowhere near close to it. But I just kind of want to see what it looks like. Because I think it takes the uh, family, the lot value and all that stuff into consideration when it uh, looks at it. Yes, it does. 8,000. Okay. We got quite a ways to go. I'm going to start ending the episode with looking at that just to make sure we've gotten some progress. So if you guys enjoyed this episode and you want to see more, please give me a like and a follow on YouTube. You can also follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, and Steam, which I will link below. Um, and also be sure to check out the rules for the Rosebud Challenge, which I will link below. I also have links for the custom content that I use, which is all at The Sims Resource. And check out links to my friends' uh, YouTube and Twitch channels below as well. Hope you guys have a great day and happy simming. Bye.